I back the blue, y'all, and my client today is a police officer from Baltimore, and I'm going to help him obtain financial freedom. John, this is your show. Let's dive in. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey, folks. Welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show here on Holton Wise TV. As always, I'm your host, James Wise. And as I said at the top of the show, uh, my client, uh, his name is John. He is a police officer from Baltimore, Maryland. So a couple things. Number one, he's blue collar. Y'all know I support blue collar guys, hard working blue collar folks. I don't want everybody out there thinking you have to be born into wealth to become a successful real estate investor. Myself, my dad, he's a truck driver. My grandpa was a truck driver, right? So I'm a blue collar guy. So I love doing videos, doing shows, working with blue collar guys. On top of that, he is a police officer, so he's the blue, baby, and we support the blue here at Holton Wise. I got to tell you guys, I threw my uh, my hat on here because, uh, you know, I just I kind of wanted to talk about this a little bit. It's driving me crazy uh, the way that America is vilifying our police officers. John is a police officer from Baltimore, Maryland, man, and you guys watch the Tennis from Hell show. You see some rough, tough stuff in some of our rougher neighborhoods. Uh, Baltimore is notorious for having tough neighborhoods, right? So that that is a tough job. And, you know, what I don't like out there in America right now, and y'all know, we get a little political on the show every now and again, right? I got my, I got my Trump fat head, and I also got my Bernie Sanders and AOC fat head, uh, complete with the communist decals. Over here, we got the 100% American, 0% socialist, because you ain't going to see no socialist pussies on this show, that's for sure. But uh, what I don't like is all of uh, the other businesses in America right now kind of just uh turning their backs on the uh brothers and sisters in blue so to speak that's 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 bs right now i'm gonna say this before anybody wants to jump to conclusions and i you know i don't want to see any comments like oh you're a racist blah, blah 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 i don't support police brutality i don't support uh anybody being attacked for their race okay one black man being killed for being black is far too many okay let me get that out there one white man being killed by police is one too many all right i don't want to see anybody of any race color creed getting attacked uh for that but on top of that what i don't want to see is people going out there with these false narratives they're they're making things up i mean we got to face the facts y'all that's what i do here on holton wise tv when i talk to you about real estate i talk to you about the truth of the business no fluff right so when i see people attacking police i see all other businesses in america attacking police i see people like my man my favorite basketball player of all time right we are based in cleveland of course you know i love lebron lebron 2016 brother greatest championship in the world but lebron said after the Jacob Blake uh, shooting, LeBron says, for black people right now, we think you're hunting us. I can't believe that statement. That is a ridiculous statement. Why? Because it's factually incorrect. Again, if one person of any color is attacked uh, for that, that is wrong. I do not support that. I disavow that. But to paint this narrative that black people are out there getting hunted guys that is insane let's just talk about the facts before we attack police officers like my guy john there are an estimated 379 i'm sorry 375 million police interactions with citizens okay that was 2019 999 of those ended up with a police shooting 14 of those were unarmed black folks, and one of those 14 unarmed black folks uh, were not attempting to resist arrest. Again, 
One is too many. But before everybody just turns their back on all the good police officers out there and everybody spreads these rumors, these false narratives that uh, folks are being hunted, let's remember those numbers. 14 unarmed, which is 14 too many. One was not attempting to resist arrest. That is one too many. But before we have this fear, this irrational fear, let's remember, folks, that on average, 27 Americans are killed by lightning every single year. So you are 27 times more likely to get struck by lightning and die than killed by a police officer. Doesn't sound like you need to be terrified. 150 people every year, on average, die from a coconut falling on their head, y'all. 100 people every year killed by bees. 200 people killed by deer. 63 people killed by their lawnmowers. You know, I think LeBron is full of shit for saying this, which brings me to my next point. 144 people die a year of constipation. Makes you kind of just want to hide, go sit in your bed, and just, you know, cry all day, right? Oh, I don't know. 680 people accidentally suffocate in their bed. 692 of them fall out of their bed and die. 94 folks, they die falling out of trees. Six are killed by spiders. 20 killed by cows. And you know what? Are you a lender? If so, Holton Wise is looking to partner with you. If you're licensed in all 50 states, go to HoltonWise.com. Click the digital media tab to advertise on Holton Wise TV today. Back to my boy, LeBron. LeBron. Again, favorite basketball player of all time. Does a lot for the community. Does a lot for the Cleveland community. We thank him for that, but I cannot back what he's been doing lately. And the shocking thing is five people on average every single year die playing basketball, right? So you're five times more likely to play basketball than be shot and killed by police if you are not resisting arrest. So with all of that said, y'all, can we please come back to reality here in America? Go back to a time when we actually treat our brothers and sisters in blue with some fucking respect because they're goddamn heroes. What happened to the thoughts that we had for these people after 9-11? It's fucking maddening to see the way that the general population is treating these folks. And even worse, that every single other business out there that I am seeing is just following this narrative. And it's, it's sickening to me. And you know what, brothers and sisters in blue? Holton Wise, we ain't going to fall in line with that bullshit because it's a false narrative. We support the brothers and sisters in blue. I wanted to make sure I got that out there. Now, John, what I'm going to do for you is I'm really going to support you. I'm going to show you how to make some money, brother. And the property I got up for you is 3192 West 38th, Cleveland 44109. Been on the market 43 days. $78,000 is the price. Now, I think that price is a little bit too high. We're going to want to get it down a little bit. Let me uh, cruise through the photos while we discuss. Now, John, what you had uh, asked me to hit for you, right? A couple things. You wanted me uh, to get you a property that had a 12% cash on cash return or higher. You were hoping after you utilized a mortgage, you're trying to cash flow at least 150 a, a door. Now, we're going to be able to do both of those with this particular property. The photos we have are of one of the units. Uh, the other unit was being vacated. Uh, tenant was supposed to be out by today, as a matter of fact. So you'll be picking this thing up totally empty. And as you can see, it's it's in pretty solid shape. Now, the thing is with rentals, and John, you already have a Section 8 rental, and then you got another regular cash-paying tenant rental. So you know that, like, the photos, right, this looks pretty good. We're not going to have to do anything major. Like, we're not going to have to replace the kitchen floor. It looks like they already got a nice vinyl plank flooring in there. Uh, as far as the kitchen cabinets, they are newer, Home Depot, Lowe's quality. And, uh, you know, the walls and stuff, they look okay. But, you know, you probably are aware of this. When you're looking at photos, okay, it's easy for them to look nice in the photos because you're like five, six, seven feet away. But when you actually get up close... 
uh, and the tenants are in there, they're seeing them, they're going to want to have us do some cleanup to them, right? So what I have factored in for you is $10,000 total of cosmetic renovations. Because of that, I'd like to see you pick the house up for $65K, right? So spend $65 to buy it, $10,000 to renovate it, brings us all in at $75,000. Now, I know you have $45,000 in cash to play with, all right? So what I'd like you to do, because the house is in good shape, it just needs cosmetic reno. I'd like you to just go ahead and utilize the loan purchase it uh, with your loan. You don't need to do a burr or anything. We're just going to be cleaning things up, right? We just need to make sure that fund's in there because, you know, once we get up close to it, it's probably not ready for tenants, okay? So we're going to factor that in. So you're going to need $16,000 uh, as your down payment than the 10000 So the total cash outlay on this deal for you of 26250 What that's going to do for you, brother, it's going to get you two tenants paying seven fifty dollars apiece, $1,500 a month, 18000 a year. Now, you know, John, right? You're a landlord. You're an experienced landlord, okay? You're aware that you ain't going to get to keep all 1500 of that every month. I have uh, broken it down for you. I anticipate you're going to spend approximately 749 of that every month, leaving you with an NOI, an average NOI of 751 or 9,012. Now, those tenants, just so you know, uh, they're going to want to be Section 8 tenants, right? Uh, you are interested in the Clark Fulton Metro Health neighborhood. You've seen some of my other shows, so that's where this property is, so you know that's a D-class property. But you are interested in this just like I like this particular neighborhood because I see good things happening in this neighborhood because Metro Health is investing a billion dollars dollars, right? It's a low-income neighborhood. Uh, we do have a decent amount of crime over there. There's some some risk factors. That's why we go Section 8 with these tenants, okay? And that $10,000 budget, unless anything pops up on that home inspection report that uh, I'm not anticipating, $10,000 of cosmetic renovations should probably get us to the point where it's 100% rent ready from a cosmetic standpoint for the tenants and also passing Section 8 inspection. Now, that could change, of course, after the uh, general home inspection. Uh, but as of right now, I'm anticipating that should cover us, right? So with the Section 8 tenants doing that, we're going to have some pretty consistent rent coming in, but we're still going to factor for non-payment of rent. We're going to factor 75. Factor 75 for those repairs and maintenance because, you know, you're going to get turnovers. And speaking of turnovers, we're going to factor 75 for the uh, vacancy, right? And then some of your other fixed stuff, taxes, insurance, Water sewer, you got to pay water sewer out here in Cleveland. If you're curious to know why that is, go to HoltonWise.com, click the property management fact. I explain it uh, in full detail. I don't want to burn time in your video here. I already burned enough with my uh, political ranting and ravings. Uh, so the rest of that info will be there. Long care, 44 bones, PM, you got to pay the man 150, right? So that's how I get to the average of 751, right? An average. Now, the 75 for repairs, uh, maintenance, vacancy and non-payment, CapEx, right? That's all going into your pocket right now. But you know the bigger ticket items are coming, right? As far as the mechanicals, right? Speaking of bigger ticket items, right? The CapEx, right? As far as the mechanicals go. Uh, I've been doing this a very long time. Listing agent didn't talk about the mechanicals, okay? So what that means is ain't none of them are brand new, brother. None of them are brand new. I was looking to see if I had another photo snuck in there uh, of the roof. I don't. Uh, they didn't talk about the roof. They didn't talk about the furnace. didn't talk about the hot water tank, okay? We're going to do the inspection. Do not believe going into this that those items are going to be newer they're not i baked that into the cake when i i gave up i came up with the price i want you to pay which is 65k i am fully anticipating our home inspector is going to tell us we are mid to end of life on both furnaces both hot water tanks and the roof cost wise hot water tanks thousand bucks you got to replace them roughly every 15 years furnaces three thousand got to replace those roughly every 30 years roof big old big old property like this, probably like a six to $8,000 roof. Now, going into this, I'm anticipating mid to end of life. If the home inspection discovers that all of those are shot or certain things are totally shot, that's going to give us a negotiation point to go back to the seller and try to get some pricing off. But I wouldn't be shocked if they're all mid to end of life. So I just want to make sure you're prepped knowing that we're not going into this assuming that they're all new because they ain't. Right? If they were, trust me, that's the first thing they'd be talking about. But with all that, the deal, it, it still kills kills your numbers, right? All in 75, that is a 12 cap with the 16250 down payment for the property plus 10000 of cosmetic renos. 
you're all in for only 26,000, banks loaning you the 48. That doubles your goal, brother. You wanted to be at a 12% cash on cash, I think you said, right? 12%. I got you a 25% cash on cash return and it is in your price range. So John, my man, my brother in blue, if you want to make an offer on this property, just reply to the private link, uh, and then we will go from there. We will try to negotiate the best possible deal on your behalf. We'll coordinate the inspection, things of that nature. After you close, Holton Wise, we're going to take care of you, brother, just like you guys take care of America, baby. We're going to handle your property management, maintenance, construction, the whole nine. We even got insurance and title. So we got your back. We'll take care of the whole thing. But we don't have to if we don't need to. If you wanted another property manager or somebody else to take care of that or anything of that nature, that's totally cool, too. It's an a la carte service here, all right? Uh, if, for whatever reason, this deal doesn't work for you, uh, just reply to the email, man. Let me know why. And uh, on your next video, I'll, I'll make some adjustments, and we'll target something else. Everybody else out there today, uh, if you are interested in working with us one-on-one -on -one like John is, just go to Holtonwise. Dot com, click the property search for sale tab, scroll down to the MLS search and analysis show like you see on your screen, and you could order any of our packages. I think the best packages, I mean, these ones are on sale right now, so this is what people's buying. Uh, the three and the four pack, we have a 10 pack as well. I think these multi pack packages, I think they're the best. Because not every deal is going to go through, right? We're trying to get some serious value out of the marketplace, right? So like right now, this particular property for John, I want him to buy it at 65000 right? But the seller right here, man, the seller has told us what they want. The seller wants 78000 So I can't guarantee this deal is going to go. But I don't want to see John pay seventy eight. I think if John pays seventy eight, I think he's overpaying, right? So that's what you're paying me for. You're paying me for my advice to try to get you good deals. But to get you good deals, they're not just like sitting out there. Like Cleveland is a really good market, uh, but it's not like magic, right? Like John's from Baltimore, man. He 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 understands. Like that's a similar market, right? There's there's tough impoverished neighborhoods in the Baltimore area. So a lot of the price points you see here in Cleveland are similar to that of Baltimore. And the reason John is coming to Cleveland is there's a deal shortage right now. He's he doesn't have enough deals to do in Baltimore, so he's trying to expand out here to Cleveland, try to get some deals. So what that means is there's competition. Uh, for the deals guys so we have to do a lot of work we got to analyze a lot of properties so because of that you want to go with the multi-packs right because it's a numbers game not every deal we do is going to go through uh, speaking of these multi-property packages and you guys putting up with me this far in the video with all the political stuff if you are watching this and you are like my man John and you are an officer Back to showing support for those police officers. You go in there, you purchase any one of these MLS search and analysis packages, and then you shoot us an email with your receipt letting us know you purchased a package, and uh, you show us proof that you are an officer of the law or a retired officer of the law. We will go ahead and double up your package for you. So if you're a police officer, you buy a three-pack, we'll give you six properties. You buy a four-pack, we'll give you eight. You buy a ten-pack. We will give you 20, folks, because that's what we do here at Holton Wise. Everybody else, if you're out there, you're watching this show right now, you're just here to learn, not ready to buy just yet, totally cool. Do yourself a solid and smash that subscribe button because Holton Wise TV is real estate investing made easy. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Discount Property Warehouse, founded by real estate visionary Robert Field, author of The Short-Term Retirement Program, is a complete turnkey solution for acquiring cash-flowing investment properties in Memphis, Tennessee. Our turnkey properties include a third-party home inspection, new HVAC with 10-year warranties, new dimensional roofs, competitive price-to-rent ratios, discounted property insurance, in-house property management, private financing, and much more. At Discount Property Warehouse, we have a staff of licensed agents standing by, ready to assist you with every aspect of the process. 
Call us today or visit us online at discountpropertywarehouse.com. Rent Tech Direct provides you with an easy to use yet robust platform for managing your properties, complete with its built-in reporting and accounting system that can be customized to fit your business. For property managers, you get advanced features like simplified owner distributions, automated management and placement fees, an owner portal, plus the software is certified for trust accounting. All this comes backed by the highest rated customer support team in the industry. Certified by third parties and ranked number one by our clients year over year, you get unlimited free access to our US-based support team by phone, email, and chat who will help you getting started or anywhere along the way. G'day everyone, it's Angela Ramora here, your favorite Australian and the founder and owner of Ohio Cashflow. Over the last five years, Ohio Cashflow has established itself as the most reputable turnkey real estate investment company in the country. We offer solid B-class properties in Toledo, Ohio. We work and live in the same areas that we sell in, so when we sell your property, your tenants become our neighbors. We only take on a handful of investors every month. So for your chance to work with one of the best in the business, please fill out our investor application form, which you can find in the video notes below. Thanks for listening. And as we say down under, I'll catch you later, mate. Is that it? Yeah, we're done. All right, cool. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest content, including video tours and analysis of investment properties that are available for sale, real estate investment education, and our most interesting encounters with tenants from hell. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy.